There's my lemon blast. She's looking as beautiful as ever. She had a great big old rat this weekend. One that I produced, of course. It's nice having my own feeders. There's the normal. Just kind of hanging out in the tree. Doing very well. Himself. He's kind of feeling shy, I guess. Let me set him in here. He might uncoil and start moving around. Hey, sniper. What's going on, buddy? Looking good. Looking good. You're getting big. Here's the albino. Just kind of hanging out. You see, he's getting pretty thick as well. Hey, buddy. There's Bubbles. Hey, baby. You're looking beautiful. Yes, you are. Wish I had a little bit of better lighting in here. Separated out the uh, the feeders from the keepers. These are the feeders. Ended up with a bunch of boys, and they have been tearing it up. I had that thing piled. They've been drinking some water too. I had to switch to this bottle. You see that? 30 ounces. They've already taken down a couple ounces today. They're doing good. <laughs> there she is. She's ready to have her next, get pregnant for her next litter. There's my breeder male. Big old boy. Oh, buddy. <laughs> and here's mama. Hey, mama. Hey, mama. <laughs> She's already pregnant. She's getting big. And the future mamas. Hey, mamas. Look at all you guys. Yeah. You don't gotta worry about nothing. You got it made. Yeah. Bunch of good girls. I've given up on trying to breed the mice. They haven't had no luck. They haven't done anything. They kinda like this little spot. I put a couple of, uh, let me flip the camera around. You see down there? I got a couple little white pieces in there, pipe covers, and I don't know if they'll turn out, but they seem to make a nice little little cover for them to hide in. Bring it up high enough so they can get the food. Got two bottles of two bottles of water. And this is my feeding chart. Look, here we go. The two of them had two mice because they're a little bigger. Not quite big enough for a rat, but big enough for two mice. Medium rat. That's a lemon blast. You see right up here, I got normal, bumblebee, lemon blast, pastel lesser, albino. If I do a weigh-in next week, so I'd show you guys kind of how I keep track of everything. A little bit of bonus footage. My yellow squash has popped up doing all right check out the size of these that's they came up huge huge asparagus you can see one right back there right here's an asparagus right there's an asparagus hopefully I get some seeds this year and this is a, a plum tree I started it's like a green plum with a red inside. I got it from my buddy Rito at work. He brought some home back from Mexico. They're pretty good. And then here's the prayer tree. Some of my bonsais that I started. I got six of them. That one's starting to bloom out. That's a... Uh, I'm drawing a blank here for a second. I'll come back to it. <laughs> This is a myrtle. It's starting to bloom up. 
I started it from seed. My buddy Rito told me that uh, you can just take a cutting of a grape and just stick that puppy in the ground. And in springtime, it'll start to grow. You see that? It's growing. Finally getting this first leaf there. And those are just grape sticks that I cut. And here's my, my bonsai peach tree. It's really filling out quite nice this year. And of course, my apple tree. My apple tree's getting big. My puppy's uh, a few years old, six, seven years old. This is another new one. That's uh, an olive branch that I cut, trimmed, and trying to root, and it's starting to grow just a little bit. And of course, I need to fertilize this one. It's my bonsai orange tree. <laughs> I'll come back to this one. That's a mulberry tree that I got from Fresno City College and we were working on it, oh, 10, 11 years ago and bonsai it. Turned out pretty nice. Oh, let's see, what else could I show you? Let's see, oh, I'm taking a few cuttings. Oh, look, see, I got, these came up in here wild. That's right, those are wild strawberries. They must have came from a bird. But as you can see, this asparagus has got all kinds of little flowers on it. Hopefully you get some seeds. Well, that's all I got for today. It's kind of bright out here. Y'all have a good one. Subscribe. And take care. Bye.